Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I wanted to talk about the Reds, talk about the week that was and the week ahead. Currently the Reds have a 69-57 record, which is uh, good for second place in the National League Central. Seven, seven and a half games back of Milwaukee, and they actually have a one game lead over the San Diego Potteries, which is very exciting for that second wildcard spot. Um, the homestand that was just finished started off very poorly for the Reds. <clears throat> Myself and others were very pissed about them losing two out of three to the Cubs. And basically, my thought was, okay, with this homestand, you need to go at least five and two. And starting off one and two really didn't set the stage. So they took the long road to get there, but they went five and two on the homestand with the four-game sweep over the Marlins. Um, just great pitching performances over the weekend. Um, this team has a stellar starting rotation. Votto had another big series. Castellanos had, had some big hits, as did Stevenson and others. Just... Right now, this team is clicking on all cylinders. Um, unfortunately, they do play in the National League Central, where, where Milwaukee is basically, you know, they're going tit for tat with the Reds. So whenever the Reds win, Milwaukee wins. And I want to say the Reds are 20 and 10 in their last 30 games. I could be wrong. And during that span of time, they actually lost a game to Milwaukee. So I'm not so much focused on that race right now as I am with the wild card with the Padres, who they've been in the tailspin. They're already sort of in panic mode. They fired their pitching coach, which is kind of a strange move. And they finished the season with uh, a number of games against the Giants and Dodgers, whereas the Reds have uh, teams like the Cubs, the Pirates, the Marlins, and other similar foes left on their schedule. So um, this week they play Milwaukee. Again, not super focused on the division race. Uh, if we sweep the series, then maybe we can talk, but they need to just continue doing what they're doing. Uh, try not to get swept. You know, Milwaukee's playing great. But uh, after this series, it starts to get a lot easier. So hang in there. Uh, a little nervous, but we'll see uh, what the Reds have in store for this uh, series against Milwaukee. So just want to give some of my thoughts about the week that was and kind of talk about uh, what to look uh, for going forward. Um, as always, I thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to you later. Until next time, take care. Bye.